Hey everyone, Thruster here, and as you can see before you, I'm not coming at you guys with good news, and, and as you can also see from the title of this video, there's a pretty big problem with Kingdom Hearts 3 currently, right now. And it doesn't have to do with the game itself. The game itself is beautiful, and it's very enjoyable from the first four hours that I've played of it on stream. But there are a couple of issues. Now, immediately after finishing my stream, and even during the stream, on YouTube, I noticed that there was a bar at the top of the stream that said copyright, copyright content had been identified, so the stream was blocked. At least on YouTube. I don't know if it was, I don't think that was the case on Twitch, though. And then after the stream finished, uh, not long after, I got a couple of emails. One of the emails, and they were both from YouTube, and when you get an email from YouTube, nine times out of ten, it is not for a good reason. Nine times out of ten, it is for a bad reason. And unfortunately, that is the case for what happened today. So what happened? Well, my videos got copyrighted. Right both the stream did, and the first, like, 27 minute uh, little uh, piece of the stream that I uploaded, both got copyright claimed. Now, normally this wouldn't be such a big deal. I ex fully expected to get copyright claimed by the uh, inclusion of the Face My Fears by Skrillex and Yutada Hikaru. I fully expected that. There, don't get me wrong, I fully expected to get a copyright claim from that, and I was fine with that, because I completely understand why. Because uh, they can't, like, just allow that song to be uh, viewable and be um, not automatically copyright claimed in certain situations. It's just not possible to do that. So they have to have a general copyright claim system in place for that specific song. They have to have it in there. And I completely understand that, and I'm fine with disputing that. However, this one down here, this visual content claim by Disney, right here, this is the big issue. This is the problem. Because this, this is ridiculous. Now, if this content ID claim was for music from Disney, I would be fine with it, like I would be with Face My Fears. If it was for, for a cutscene, I would be a little upset, and I would consider Disney to be absolute jerks, but I would be accepting of it because, you know, just go ahead and dispute it and all that, and it's just fine. But the fact of what it's for and what it amounts to is ridiculous, what the copyright claim is for. Not only that, but what's even more ridiculous, is this video blocked in all countries bit? That's from Disney! That's not from Face My Fears. Face My Fears only caused this video to be restricted in some countries. This visual content claim by Disney caused it, causes it to not be visible in all countries. It has been blocked in all countries. Which, as a result, means that I cannot upload this video and have everyone see it. Well, now that I disputed it, maybe I can, and people will be able to see it just fine. However, at first, I couldn't do that until I disputed it. Which is completely ridiculous. Especially, again, what it amounts to here. We're gonna play the match. And you guys will see just what this content claim is for. From 1047 to 1059. And it's going to take a minute to load in, because I'm, it's being played, there we go. This is what it's for, ladies and gentlemen. They're probably going to be more cutscenes. This is what that visual content claim is for, for the Kingdom Hearts logo appearing in the goddamn video. That's right, the Kingdom Hearts 3 logo, not even the Kingdom Hearts 3 logo, not even that, just some text of the Kingdom Hearts 3 words scrolling around the screen in a circular motion, and then laying out flat on screen, has been matched as a visual content claim by Disney. Let that sink in for a moment, okay? Text swirling around on screen, and then coming out to form three, no, two words, and then three Roman numerals. That, excuse my language, that is stupid. That is the stupidest mother 
friggin' thing I have ever seen. Why? Why is that in there? Why, Disney? That is a huge slap in the face, because Disney damn well knows that people are going to be playing this game, Kingdom Hearts 3, that everyone has been waiting for for 13 god dang years since 2006 when Kingdom Hearts 2 wrapped up. People have been waiting to play this game for a long time, so people are going to be playing this game on Twitch, YouTube, Mixer, everywhere. And yet, Disney decided to include this in the copyright ID system. They decided to throw this little 12 second clip of text swirling around on screen and then coming out to form Kingdom Hearts 3. Not even the logo for Kingdom Hearts 3, because that is entirely different. An entirely different text, entirely different format, not even the same color as the actual Kingdom Hearts 3 logo. Literally, just letters, random, like not even, oh, oh, I need to take a moment. As you can tell, I'm pissed. I am not happy about this, because this is ridiculous. I'm pissed. I'm not happy at all. This is a big problem for content creators specifically, and this should not be in place. Disney? That ain't right. That's Again, excuse my language, but that's Or text swirling around on a screen! And not only that, it would be bad enough if it was just that, because that wouldn't be bad enough. That already makes Disney just a whole bunch of jerks, essentially. But the fact that the video is blocked in all countries is just like a huge slap in the face. Like, what the hell? Like, why? 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 What's the point of this, Disney? This is ridiculous. Why would you want to have this game created? Something that people have been waiting for for a long time. And then decide to just... Copyright claim. The most insignificant thing of all time. Text! Text on screen! <sighs> I'm not happy. I'm not happy at all. I am very unhappy right now. As if you couldn't already tell, this... Uh, for the last 12 hours, I've been very unhappy with this. Because it's stupid. And this isn't the only problem with Kingdom Hearts, unfortunately. Kingdom Hearts 3. I ordered my game, pre-ordered it, through Amazon. So, for those of you who know what that means, or don't know what that means, I also got a promotional code for a Dusk Till Dawn Keyblade DLC item for Kingdom Hearts 3. As you can see here, though, there are issues with redeeming the Dust Till Dawn Keyblade DLC for Kingdom Hearts 3. And it's all on Microsoft's end. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm dealing with right now. Well, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed listening to me rant and be angry about Disney and their stupidity and the stupid stuff that they're doing and the crap that they're doing to content creators. This right here is far worse than anything that Nintendo ever did. Okay? Far worse than anything they did. Why do I say that? Because when Nintendo did that, at least they had good grounds, okay? It was about their games fully and entirely. They freaking copyright claimed whole cutscenes from games, okay? They copyrighted whole cutscenes. Let that sink in. And then realize Disney's not even doing that. They're strictly copyright claiming visual content that amounts to, once again, for the 15th time, text swirling around on screen in a circular motion and then coming out to form a set of words. I don't think Nintendo ever did anything like that. They copyright claimed pictures and videos of the menus for uh, certain games. Sure, they definitely did. But they never did something for something as simple as this. I forgot at this point to actually mention one other thing. If Disney is willing to put uh, visual content like this into the content ID system, then what is to stop them from putting 
a whole lot more into the content ID system. Because again, as I've mentioned countless times in this video already, they just put swirling text and then text appearing on screen into a content ID system on YouTube. The chances of them doing more than that are quite high, in my opinion. <clears throat> so that's just my take on this, though. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I really do hope that you enjoyed listening to someone rant about something so fiercely and angrily as I have. Because that was actually very nice and very fun. Anyways, if you like this video, be sure to hit that like button. Also, consider hitting the subscribe button to get notifications for my next upload a video. Don't forget to also check out links down below in my description for my Twitch, my Patreon, my Streamlabs, my Twitter, my other YouTube channel, and all that other stuff down in the description below. Don't forget to also comment down below what you thought of this, and don't forget to share this video on social media. Now, with all that being said, thank you guys once again for coming out to this video. Uh, and may your heart be your guiding key.